wait, wait, wait. I just put on this lipstick called, mm, let's see here. Okay, so this is by Yves Saint Laurent and it's called, oh geez, God, don't tell me I'm getting old. I mean, all right, I can't read it, sorry. 209, oh, oh geez, 209. <laughs> this is a result of the accident. Welcome back to my channel. I was recording a video, watching a Jewish couture video where she's got her black and white print blouse on and she said she thought she had cougar vibes on. I recorded this video in these pants. That's right, sure did. That's right. Without even knowing, I was wearing cougar mom pants, I guess, like whatever. It matches my bag, okay? Forgive the nails. They are not gonna be done for today's video because your girl was in an accident, like a terrible accident. And so everything I feel like gets put into perspective when your mortality comes into question. And I know that I've got some bags here that I'm going to be doing a review for you. But I just want to take a moment first to say welcome if you're new to my channel and welcome back if you're already a subscriber. I do appreciate all of the views that I have been getting. I'm relatively new to YouTube. I wanted to tell you why I started this channel real quick is because I realized during the pandemic that life is actually short. And now having this car crash on a highway where someone literally crashed into me on the highway into a divider, into the highway divider. I just feel like when you hear stories like that on the news, it's not you. That they're talking about it's somebody else and i can't believe it because those are the stories where you hear about people dying so i guess what i just want to say is bags are bags but i was really happy to be alive and see my husband and my two kids and i'm really happy to i'm really happy sorry to have found community of people on youtube who really enjoy and appreciate my videos. I wanna do some quick shout outs for this video because this last video that I made is, is blowing up and I just wanna thank you guys for subscribing, for watching. Welcome new friends. Let me just thank first Jerusha Couture from Australia who commented on this last video I made about the utility phone sleeve. Thank you, babe. Like seriously, I appreciate the love because you know it's really cool to have someone who I think is a little bit more well established on the community on YouTube do shout outs like that you know stop by breeze through pass by and give some love to those who are new but share a similar passion so I think that was really cool I also want to shout out some new subbies welcome new subscribers new friends welcome to my channel Sasha Walker Miss Coco Style Jamie Bowman, Danae MJ, Elise James, Steven Shanks, Over and Out, Mickey's Vlog, Kovacs, Gaber, 0707. Okay, look, I'm sure I won't be able to do that for every video, but I will definitely find a way to shout out my new subbies somehow. So stay tuned. You never know if it could be you. I started a YouTube channel because I wanted to find my people. I wanted to find friends that share in the love of Louis Vuitton the way that I do, who enjoy the history. And I speak French. I really love that this is a French brand. I came to know Louis Vuitton by a coworker. A coworker actually introduced me to this brand and I just really fell in love with it. I actually saw her bag on her desk. It was the Damia Ben. And I asked her, what kind of bag is that? Because I really like patterns. I didn't even know what kind of brand it was. She said it was Louis Vuitton. And then I started to do some research on Louis Vuitton. I actually watched the history of Louis Vuitton. I read the history of Louis Vuitton. I really wanted to better understand where this brand came from before I started spending so much money on it. And so I really came to understand sort of that the development, the creation, the origins of this brand came from hardworking people 
who just put together like suitcases and trunks, sold it to rich people or anybody who could afford it. But people who were like going on boats, people who were traveling like to the new world back in the days, like this is like a hundred year old company or something like that. This is legit. I think that's amazing. I love fashion. I've always loved fashion growing up. That's the reason also why my channel is about bags. I have another channel that is not about bags. It's about everything else because I also find things in the world that's interesting like this accident as well as life hacks. I want to share that information. I would love to share it with this audience. I don't know what the interest is. Um, so check out my other vlog channel, Kanisha. Seven S's. Why not? <laughs> okay, on to the video. I wanted to make this video for you guys. I said to myself, if they love this video so much, right, about the utility phone sleeve, these friends would definitely love to know why they should get either of them, right? Wouldn't you want to know? If you only had money and budget for one of these, which of these should you get? I would want to know because I understand out here, we are all not living with disposable income. I started a YouTube channel for all these bags that I buy. I want to share with you why I buy them, how I use them, so you can get a really good idea of how and when you want to spend your money. And like I said, sorry, I apologize for the nails. This accident really messed up my game and I couldn't get to the nail salon to get my nails done in time to make this video and I want to stay on schedule because Nails aren't done, your girl's alive, and these videos will continue. So I said to myself, would they be interested, right? And so I said, I wonder if you guys would be interested in a video comparison. I guess we'll see. I don't have so much disposable income that I'm just buying closets full of bags. That's not what I am doing out here. And I also want to buy the real thing. So I know a lot of people who watch my channel are buying replica bags because you guys have been telling me okay you've been telling me you've been asking me questions about the replica bags I don't buy replica bags anyway when I was young in my my teens early 20s when I was first starting out before I had a career and before I actually knew what these brands were all about I bought fake bags I did not know they were fake I went to the Bahamas I went on trips they happened to be there. I had never been to a fashion house store before. Who knows how to find one when you have no money, when you're 18, when you're 20? Like seriously, it doesn't even make any sense. So don't give me a lot of flack for that. But all I'm saying is I can understand why people buy replica bags. You don't know no better, right? But I think what you guys are telling me is you're going online to sites that produce these bags that look just like the real thing to each their own. I don't subscribe to that, right? So you know where I stand. But if you're here for the information about these beautiful bags, I am here for you, friends. I am here. That is what I am here to do. So I can't tell you about those sites, but I can tell you about the real deal. So stay tuned, okay? Stay tuned.